back to the broadcast. We have a lovely show, Dennis Rodman, Susan Molinari. Let's bring out our first guest. What do you say, Paul? Yeah. There you go. Our first guest is the uh, most colorful, controversial, and tattooed player in all of basketball. Yeah. That's right. He has uh, led the NBA in uh, rebounds for the last uh, five years and has written this best-selling book right here entitled Bad As I Wanna Be, a person reading aloud from it in the audience right now. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, from the Chicago Bulls, please welcome back Dennis Rodman. It's not his actual hair, it's not but it generates a genetic response. <laughs> you can't help yourself. <laughs> How you doing? I'm doing great. How about you? Ah, pretty good. Thank you very much for coming back to the program, and uh, congratulations on a championship there in Chicago. Well, Must have been thanks. very exciting for you, huh? Uh, it was all right. Uh, <laughs> it, was, it was all right. Was, was this year uh, the best basketball you've played? In your life, do you think or not? No, no really? No, no, no. It's just because I was on the Chicago Bulls. That's it. But but as a as a teammate, as part of that machine, did that elevate your game somehow? Did you help elevate their games? No, not really. I, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, you know, 1989, 90 was a good year, and this year was more gratifying just because you know I proved a lot of people wrong that uh -huh. I I'm not crazy if everyone think I am. Right. You know. But there was never any question about you being a great ball player. So that was never in doubt, right? Well, um, I'm that, but, you know, <laughs> I'm a good ball player. People just don't understand that I'm smart and intelligent. Did you fit in well with the team? Did, did, you, did all the players like it? Did you get along with all the guys? Oh, yeah, we got along. You know, we had, uh, you know, we had the, the black and white, but we mixed together and made it, you know. <laughs> good answer. Good answer. <laughs> And then um, you, you sign a uh, contract uh, at the end of it. You're back there in Chicago for another year. Is that the uh, one more year? One more year. Is, one, is that what you wanted? Just another year there? Um, yeah. And yeah. is this because uh, Michael Jordan signed a contract for one year, and you just thought, well, if he's going to be there one more, I'll be there one more? Well, I just think that I just, you know, I'm, I'm pretty much um, kind of, I'm kind of burned out right at this particular time. But I'm going to go one more year, see so if I can do it again. Right. Right. And after next year, I might just think about retiring. See what happens. Oh, you might yeah. retire. Yeah. What would you do when you retire? Man, people taking it personally. They take it totally personally. Uh, and what would you do when you retired? I got a lot of things I'm doing right now. Yeah, what kind of stuff? I got uh, I got a movie coming out next year. Mm -hmm. I got. Well, tell uh, me about the movie. What is the film? The film. The film is about. Um, uh, well, it's, 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 the film is called The Colony. The Colony. Yeah, well, I call him Sean Claude Van Dom. That's uh -huh. what I call him. So, uh, he's, he's about yay tall. So basically, he's gonna be my partner. Can yeah. you imagine is, that? Is you and, uh, and Van Dam in the film then? Yeah. Yeah, that's and, interesting. Uh, Mickey Rourke is the bad guy. Mickey Rourke? Yeah. Well, you this casting it? gets more and more interesting. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, um... Yeah. 500 Mickey Rourke fans. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and what is the film about, Dennis? It's about... <laughs> um... It's... It's... It's, it's about, um... Me being a, uh, the middleman, as far as um, Sean is an FBI agent. Right. And he decides that he wants to retire from the business. So he just cannot retire from it, but they got to ship him to this island mm -hmm. with the rest of the guys. Right. And uh, he can't leave the island because he knows too much information. But all of a sudden, he figures out that this guy's been chased for two years. It's back home now. He has his girlfriend. Now his girlfriend's going to have a baby, blah, blah, blah. Now he got to come back and get this guy. Is it a musical? Uh, well. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I'm nuts. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm talking about. Ah. Uh, okay. You got a lot of stuff going on, and then I heard today or yesterday that you're getting married. Congratulations. Nice going. Oh, thanks a lot. Yeah, when are you, when are you getting married? Huh? When are you getting married? 
Oh, tomorrow at 12.30. You getting married tomorrow at 12.30? Yeah. Where, where about, here in town? Uh, Rockefeller Center. Rockefeller Center. Well, good for you. Who, who is the, uh, the lucky woman? Uh, she is a beautiful and talented woman. Yeah? Well, congratulations. Yeah, thanks a lot. Yeah, I hope it works out well for you. All right. All right. We got to uh, do a commercial. We'll be right back with Dennis Rodman. <laughs> Bad as I want to be. That's the name of the book. Susan Molinari, you're a Republican, aren't you, Dennis? Yes, I'm not. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> Neville Brothers will be here. Did you write the book yourself? Did you write it with somebody? I wrote it with someone. And, and this is uh, your life story or like the last couple of years of your... Oh. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> nice. Well, well, nice yeah, crack, huh? Yeah. <laughs> So you know, what about the Olympic uh, dream team this time around? Were you, you not on this dream team? Uh, how do you feel about that? And uh, what are your thoughts about, you know, the Olympics and basketball and that kind of thing? Well, I don't think I would have had any fun. Really? Just how come you weren't on that team? Uh, just because, look at me. <laughs> 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 yeah, well, yeah. Uh, so, I mean, just look at me. They don't, they don't want something like this representing the United oh, States. Come no, but, it, but it, it's, a, it's about all people. That's what the Olympics are about. Well, Doesn't make any difference what you look like. It's hard to deal. It's hard to deal. It's hard to deal out there. <laughs> What is, the, uh, what is, what is the, the giant bus we saw you getting off of when you came in? What is that? Why do you have a bus? Let me explain this. You yeah. know, I have, I have the MTV show. This is the Rodman World Tour black bus out there, okay? All right. That's, that's my wow, World that's Tour true. bus out there, okay? Where, where do you go in the bus? See, that is right there. That's the, that's the Rodman World Tour bus. I, I go all over. Can you give me a ride home? I, I give you a ride home. I, I give you a ride to a lot of places. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'll bring it to the bus. <laughs> okay? You know, Robin World 2 is all about, you know, doing wild, crazy things like I rent G3s, I, I rent Rolls Royces, things like this. I take showers with, them, with people and... You take you know, showers with people. Uh, and, you know, you know I, had, I had a card game with, you know, Pat Smear, the Food Fighters, and uh, Kelsey Grammer, they French kiss on my show, so, you know, and all things French like that. French kiss on your show? Oh, yeah. Wow. Isn't that exciting? That's, you know, in the old days, you just bring guests out. You have yeah, like a desk yeah. and you have a couple of chairs. No. And you would talk. No, and it, my show's not like that. You have to have it's people not, it's, come it's on like French that. kiss. It's not like that. But, you know, all the guests go on my show have to get their hair painted green. So I just happen to have a little spray bar here to paint your hair green. <laughs> They just like. Oh, I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Good luck with the book. Good luck with the uh, coming uh, wedding. We have to pause when we come back. Susan Molinari will join us. That's in case. That's in case people are wondering if there's something different about my hair. Right. <laughs> we show them now exactly what happened. That's right. This looks like many. Now get a nice tight shot of this head here. This looks like many items in my refrigerator. <laughs> kind of round, kind of large, kind of green, kind of hairy. Yeah. Oh no. Thank you very much, sir. <laughs>